Good day Pinoy Clixers and Mixers, welcome back to the channel and for this video, we're going to look at Deadpool riding a unicorn. Let's go! Okay, so we have here again Deadpool riding a unicorn, in this case a purple or I would say violet unicorn. <laughs> so anyway, so this is for 14 years and up and definitely we fall in that category and this is MEA-004 Marvel Comics Deadpool Mini Egg Attack series. So MEA stands for Mini Egg Attack from Beast Kingdom, Mini Egg Attack and Marvel. That's the front. And you can see the window containing our character. We will get to that a, li a little bit later. We also have here some other Deadpool from this particular series, MEA. Okay, so Deadpool with a kitten and a couple of word bubbles. Deadpool as a maid and Deadpool as Cupid. Now, what was I doing as mentioned by Deadpool here? On the other side, we have Deadpool slashing with the sword. This is what we have. Deadpool hooting with the unicorn. And the last one is Deadpool with mini Deadpools with a heart sign. Okay. I, I love I actually love this one but uh, this is something I purchased in my Korea trip and this was the only Deadpool available if I'm not mistaken this was also available but not this particular variant okay so I had no choice but to go with the Deadpool and unicorn don't worry I, I love this particular figure as well at the back are all six of the variants together. Okay, when was this created? 2018, so a bit of a throwback. Okay. And at the bottom, you can see here the price, 17,000 won. So you can just use your local uh, currency converter. Okay, I got this from iPark Mall in Korea. As I said, so before we get into unboxing this Deadpool, let's take a look at a uh, Heroclix figure that's also Deadpool riding on a unicorn. We don't have it because that particular figure is an Ultra Chase, but I'll just show you from my screen. That is Deadpool riding on a unicorn and you can even see the rainbow effect that's also going to be included if you actually pull this particular figure this is from the deadpool and the x-force set if i'm not mistaken and i don't have it because this is what we call an ultra chase figure so set number 69 from the set ultra chase rarity that's one step higher than your chases and not all the um, sets have an ultra chase okay so you can see here i don't have one but i want to have one let's take a look at his uh, dial for 140 points he has the Mystic Steam ability and 6 range, 11 charge, 12 penetrating damage, and 4 exploit, and 18 special defense power for tap dial. Okay. The special defense power is impervious once per game. When Deadpool would take damage, you may choose that it takes no damage instead. 
So he just completely ignores damage at least or at max once per game. He, he has the animal, Deadpool core, and mystical keywords. And of course, we know he is Wade Wilson. Aside from that, he has improved movement. He, he ignores hindering terrain. Uh, does not really matter in the new rules. But he does ignore hindering terrain as well for targeting. So that still matters. And he has a couple of traits. The first one... That horn just ain't for show. At the beginning of your turn, if Deadpool has no action tokens, he can make a close attack using Blade Claws Fangs. So, since he is standard, you can carry him. And then next turn, he can make a close attack for free using Blade's Claws and Fangs. And second trait is I'm here to spread joy and rainbows. I'm here to spread joy and rainbows. When Deadpool hits an opposing character, after actions resolve, you can place the rainbow, rainbow joy marker on that character. Here's the rainbow joy, joy marker. Okay. Removing it from anywhere else. A character with a rainbow joy marker cannot attack Deadpool unless it is the only character on its force. At the beginning of its player's turn, a character with a Joy Boy Rainbow Joy marker <laughs> can roll a D6. On a result of 5 or 6, they may remove the Rainbow Joy marker. So, uh, to some extent, the character becomes an ally or neutral at, at least against Deadpool until he removes that on a roll of 5 or 6 or if he is the only character on its force. So it might be best to put that on the highest point character of your opponent so that uh, he can't fully utilize it at least for that for Deadpool against Deadpool Unicorn. Okay, so again one last look at the gloriousness of Rainbow Deadpool Unicorn Deadpool. Okay, so we're, before we look back at our own version of Deadpool Unicorn. See, okay, let's take a look. Uh, this one I'd probably keep myself. Okay, I'll try to sell it, but if it doesn't sell, then I I can keep it or give it to one of my niece. <laughs> okay. Let's see what's included in the box. Okay, we have a cardboard background. We have the protector gel. And that's it. Let's pop it out. Okay, so this is Deadpool riding a unicorn. It's quite heavy. It's quite solid. I give it that. Oops. Does it stand? It should stand. There you go. Okay. So you see the front, the side, the other side, and the back. With double katanas, of course. Bottom, Marvel, okay, top as well. Okay, so that's it for the video. Deadpool Unicorn, going your way. Bye-bye.